In today's vlog, you join me here at the same place as we had the Jap Go Japan Festival. We have got the National Old Timers Festival. So, there's some old timers, and should I say young timers too, in the cars. But we have a quick look around. Yeah, we'll come have a proper look just now. We're going to start one side and come back. But you can see Renault Clio V6, Ferrari, little buggy. Then we got a, an old uh, Willis Jeep there, and all that. Some beautiful, beautiful cars. But we'll definitely come back and have a proper look. We're going to start the one end and carry on from there. Join me on the other side of the festival, and we're going to start from this side. We have this beautiful old convertible Merc. It has done also a beautiful car. Got a bit of an old Volvo here. This beautiful Mercedes. What's it? SR 190? Really, really beautiful car. And we got this old 911 in the golf colors. Hard worker, matching harnesses, plexiglass back. See the proper Porsche style interior. Yeah. Let's have a look in there. Hey, that's <laughs> pretty cool. Yeah, look what I'll say. So, old BMW, Opel, Citroen 2 CV, the classic BMW 2002, and buggy, another Citroen 2 CV. We've got this beautiful yellow Citgo. And this awesome Datsun 240Z. These two together. Just look at the color contrast. How cool does that look? And then we just got an Austin Healy that pitched up. And we got this Golf, the 16 valve motor. Check out E-Top. And the Austin Healy looks really, really cool. So yeah, I'll see what that. Here's some very cool cars I came across. We got this Porsche 911. I don't know if it's a rally car, it must be a rally car with the mud flaps. But it just looks so cool. Look at the roll cage under the dash there. No car presented. This is a full rally car. This looks so cool. And the rally lights. So, yes, definitely a rally car. But road registration, everything. Damn cool, dude. Very cool. Then we got the stock Porsche. You can see the difference. Obviously, it's different in your generation, but it gives you an idea. Then we've got these beautiful alphas. I've always loved these alphas. The body lines on them and that are just so good. So, obviously, that's a mustard color. That's red. I always have to say, alpha and red. You have to go red. But damn beautiful cars. Another cool little car we came across is this Mini Cooper in like a cyan blue. Look how cool this looks. It's like a bit of a baby blue cyan color. But it's got the Tiffany type interior. It is a beautiful, beautiful looking car. Really beautiful looking car. Yeah? What do you guys think? Do you think it's pretty cool? I think it's pretty cool with the matching interior in that. It's a quite a cool rare car I just came across. Yeah, but you don't see them there. It's this Porsche 912. But original. Look how beautiful this thing is. Yeah, yeah. Look how clean this thing is. Beautiful, beautiful car. Really, really a beautiful car. Original rims yeah. from the interior. That is so cool. That's something really cool to see. But yeah, it's something also another Porsche. Should look like a yellow bird, I think they call them. I don't think it's a true yellow bird. But damn, this is cool. With the GT style bucket seats. <laughs> Multicolor steering wheel, yeah. the wide body Carrera RS. 
Really, really great looking car. We sort of drive in and we're like, that is really cool. We're going to see a driver now. So while we're here, we got this awesome bagged Mercedes W18. Oh, it looks so wicked bagged. Look at this. Black and grey interior. Hey. <laughs> that looks good, looks good. Really cool. Really cool, eh? Looks very different bag, doesn't it? That's what I love about it. It's so uh, a little bit unconversion. Unconversion? You know, not the norm. But I think it's really cool. And yeah, we got this old land, Church of Land Cruiser. How cool is this? This is proper, proper old school, this. Yes, my camera's too close, man. It's so cool, eh? Really, really cool. Proper old school Land Cruiser. That is, if I have an old school off-road vehicle, there it is, right there. Here's quite a cool little modified car. Here's a Golf one with Aero 16 rims. Bagged, as you can see, in the Martini colors. You can see it's fully bagged. You can see the airbag in the back, but it's got Porsche seats in it and a special shift and all that. But this thing looks really cool. So clean. Got a half cage? Yeah, half cage. The tire steering wheel, that looks really, really good. Check from the distance. That's such a good little present, but it's not overdone. No, no, no. Hey, I've just also noticed, check, look at the Porsche. The Porsche uh, calipers. Those are proper aftermarket calipers. They're not standard. Dude, this thing. This year definitely has my respect. In this section of the show, we got a little bit more of the modern stuff. We got a Porsche, Merc, all that. But these two things I really want to show you. These are two Renault V6 Clios. The original one and the facelift one. But look how we get these two together. So if you don't know what the Renault Clio V6 is, it's not just the V6. The V6 is in there. It's in the back. But I've always liked how you, you see the inductions for the engine on these things. Everything has got a function on this car. And it's so beautiful. These two, these two are just amazing to see. You can see a big difference between the, the original and the facelift. I do like the facelift more, I'm not going to lie. But, you know, that's, they obviously did the facelift job well, you know. Not saying the first one is ugly. And the V6 sits in the back there. It's such a kick-ass car. These things must be fun to drive. Not race drive, but cruise drive. Like a baby GT supercar type vibe. Really, really cool. Thought I'd just show you guys that. So you're a little bit different. So we're about the main uh, stage area at the moment. So I'm going to show you some of the cool cars around here. Well, uh, old Volkswagen. I have no idea what that is. Old Morris. Yes, in South Africa used to get a lot of those. Old Ford, Volvo, old Buick. We got the automobile. Yeah, the awesome old timers. You got the awesome uh, Fiat 500 at Bath. How cool is that? Then the Fiat, I think it's a 500 L, 600. I oh, forget that. Then we've got the Jaguar E Top. The Pontiac GTO. Come on, how cool is a GTO? Oh, you, you can't, you can't deny that GTO. Really can't. Sorry about the noise in the background, guys. 
Then we got this awesome, another Renault Clio V6. That is, this is again the facelift version. Really great looking car. Then we got this old Porsche 9, 911. A Triumph. Austin Healy 3000. This is, this. This is fantastic. We got this awesome bug. Alonso Dalton Tirole. That is wicked. More Austin Healy's. Another Austin Healy. An MG. I think it's this an MG, this. Yes, another MG. You pause, right? And then how this is Bentley. This is a built thing, if I'm right. Then we got all the Cobras. There's always a lot of traffic at the show, people coming in and out. Of course, we got a golf one. But look at all these wicked Shelby's Cobras. All these Cobra replicas. And then, with this Mercury, which you don't see many of, but this Fastback Mustang. That's game on, bro. How beautiful is this? This is such a beautiful car. With the Shelby rims in it. Oh. This is just so. This is iconic muscle car, right there. Do you agree with me? Do you think that's iconic muscle car? Then we do have other two cars here Lotus Esprit, the door wedge. <laughs> this is the original Lotus Esprit. Then we got an MG, uh, MGB. And then we got a Lotus 7, but I don't know if there's a Caterham or what, the, the Donkervoort. So it's based, it's the original Donkervoort, based off the Caterhams. I just saw the badge, says Donkervoort, and it'll say the interior is a bit different, yeah. Beautiful car, beautiful, beautiful. I always said, if you want fun in a little small lightweight car, that's the way to go. Here's a few more little cars I want to show you. So we got this little Daihatsu Copen. We were looking at this thing. It's so cool. Imagine taking something like this and putting it, making it a rear wheel drive little monster. I think it would be fun. Make it like a little drift car. It's so cool. Look at the interior on this. It's got Momo steering on. That comes down with that. There's got Ricardo seats and I think these are, I don't know if they're aftermarket, eh? Then we got obviously Oscar's here. Oscar's come to visit. Got the GTR here. RC3. Big single ass turbo. Beautiful color. Same blue as the Supra. Looking good. And then look what's in the boot. Well, Oscar's got problems. There's another cool car. Here it goes. This Daytona Coupe, but I think it's like a factory fire body kit or something. It's not a real a Daytona, real, and on no, not a proper replica either. It's like a, a modernized replica, should I say? Looks very cool. I think it's like a factory five replica or something. All the disc brakes, interior is quite modern. So they're there for the induction. Really, really cool. Hello, Oscar. Oscar now. Nah. Hey Oscar. Yeah. <laughs> I've come across this Mercedes E55 AMG, but with the world's biggest wing for the downforce. <laughs> how much horsepower do you think that adds? <laughs> it's a real uh, AMG, yeah. yeah. But how much horsepower do you think the wing adds? Yeah. <laughs> More than a sticker. <laughs> plus five? <laughs> plus five? <laughs> Ah, oh, that is just brilliant. That is brilliant. But you can see it's a real AMG. <laughs> oh, it's just brilliant. I love the laughing. Okay, and here, what are you saying? Uh, let's get back here, Dodge. A little mad Scarlet over here. And then we got awesome Ford Cosworth RS. How wicked is this thing? Hey, that is so cool to see. This is something you really don't see many of. I think you see more Supras and Skylines in these. Yeah. Really wicked cards. See, and with the uh, Oz rims, 
Oh, is it rooms? It looks really cool. There's a little looper. Well, half a looper train tied. <laughs> That's so cool to see. Old silica. A big bus. Let's see what else it is. Quickly, yeah? Uh, what do we want now? Chota. Chota. Fuck, what is this? That's cool. Big VW bus. Trying out mini. That's a big bus, eh? A little mini. <laughs> Chef convertible. We are walking on our way out the show at the moment. We're going to see what else we can see. Well, awesome yellow Porsche. That looks very cool. Maserati. How's the Peugeot? That looks good. That Peugeot looks really cool. Then we've got the, some of the Chev trucks, the Volvos, and all that. VW. VW M3 is probably, I still say, the best M3 there is. So that basically does it. Not too much to see. Um, great show, good show, as always. Um, some cool cars, different costs also compared to last year. So about the same amount. Actually, maybe a little bit, a few more cars than last year. But great event. See you everyone. Have a fantastic day. If you enjoyed the video, we'll see you soon.